Hello guys. While I don't say to, hmm, Anambra APC leaders slammed Tunubu's appointment of Bianca Ojuko as minister. They call it betrayal. Well, Nigeria, this is getting more interesting. What is going on? Let's find out. But before then, guys, if you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Please like us now. Share this video. Let it go viral. Thank you and God bless you. The All Progressive Congress, APC, leaders in Anambra State, have openly condemned President Bola Tunubu's deci decision to appoint Ambassador Bianca Ojuku as a minister designate. They described the move as a betrayal of party principles and raised concerns about the potential impact on the party's unity in the region. During an emergency meeting of APC stakeholders held in Oka on Thursday, party leaders voiced their frustration over the appointment. They characterized it as a breach of party loyalty that risks the moralizing APC supporters in Anambra State. High Chief Bonte Onwibo, the South is Zonal Secretary of the APC and a member of the APC Elders Forum in Anambra spoke on the behalf of the consigned stakeholders. He emphasized that the president's move undermines party coercion by favoring individuals associated with rival political fashions. This is nothing but as art of anti-party and it is the, the trementa. Onwigbo declared, by empowering members of other political parties at the expense of the APC in Anambra State, Mr. President is not supporting party loyalty. Onwigbo raised concerns about the recent appointment, questioning its implications. Is the President aiming to trigger a mass defection of APC members in Anambra to the All Progressive Grand Alliance, ABGA? Is he sub to supporting Abga's interest in Anambra State? He described the situation as unprecedented and deeply discouraging, expressing frustration that the national leadership appears to be boosting opposition parties at the expense of the APC. Onibo accused Abga of monopolizing benefits from government programs and empowerment schemes, claiming they cater exclusively to their members while taking undue credit for in initiative meant to involve all political stakeholders. This is a party that openly rejects the APC and wants no affiliation with us. Yet Mr. President is empowering them with this appointment, he stated. Honorable added that APC stakeholders would formally present their complaints to the state chairman of the party, Chief AGDK, for onward submission to the National Working Committee, NWC, and the National Executive Council, NEC. See, these people, they don't even know that Tinubu is even smarter. You understand? Tinubu know what he's doing, you know. Tinubu know what he's doing. See, uh, <laughs> let me not just go there. Let's quickly hit the comment section. Let's hear what Nigerians have to say concerning this. One thing you guys should know is that Tinubu appoints his cabinet across board. Okay. Uh, another person said, uh, we the Igbos don't even care about the so-called appointment because what's the appointment making her? A minister of state okay why not the main minister or for better something better if at all t pain wants to remember Igbos. we Igbos only deal with people that have political value hey so this one is trying to say that uh, bianca Ujuku you not get political value so the appointment to to, to him they will not be anything Another person said, on his mandate, Anambra people stand to APC never cares about competence, only compensation and favorism. 
they should go and hang transformer anyway. But is considering political value individuals from Southeast, he is, you know, glamoury setting up 2027. Ah, uh, really? So, uh, Bianca Ojuku gets political value for Southeast. Someone they ask, she does not have any political value even in her world. She cannot deliver. So just go and ask. Well, Nigerians, this Bianca Ojuku appointment by President Bola Metinubu, they really they cause buzz uzo. Okay, even from where she came from, they are not happy. And uh, some persons too. Uh, talking about uh, Biafra agitators, the Biafrans, they consider talk say maybe eh, eh, Tinubu wants to use Bianca Ojuku to bribe them, but there is no how he will go about this. Biafra no neg ne Biafra is no negotiable, you know. Biafra can never be uh, negotiated, uh, be negotiated by anyone. Okay, that Biafra is go go. That is what they are sustaining. So, guys, make a drop out for you. Uh, things are getting more interesting. Uh, kindly drop your comments below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Please share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you.